Hey guys, it's Syndicate here, and welcome to another publicious commentator from myself. And I am back with more zombies now. A lot of people was wondering like what happened to like my uh, channel and everything like that. Um, I wasn't here for like two days because I had no internet because my dad actually stole it. And you'll probably hear him in the background. He's watching a uh, celebrity juice if you've never heard of that before. And someone said in the comments they want to uh, hear me just do a commentary. They like they prefer my commentator uh, where it's just me talking normally. So you know what? For him today, I'm actually just going to do like a straight normal commentary. But I'm just going to talk about gaming. Um, like not <laughs> not just like gaming, but it's kind of sort of is I suppose <laughs> um, a response to pa holy crap everyone always texts me whilst I'm actually trying to do a video but it's a response to pyro um, like to sorry to pyro pyro punches video that I put out when he talked about how the community not the community change how YouTube's progressed and yeah basically how everyone has improved their like video making styles or whatever whenever but the community itself has changed um, it's become better I believe and it will continue to be something awesome uh, which well not something awesome it will be something awesome and it always continue to be something awesome because there's just new and newer and newer boobalicious commentary like and content coming out all the time and it's good to see like if you went back in the day like three years ago like Pyro did a video where he showed his montage where a montage wasn't all these, you know, like these graphical effects where like it flies in a room and then like some, you know, like crazy, I don't know, CGI editing or something like that, like from, what's it called, um, <laughs> God, I've completely forgot, uh, something from like, um, I don't know, and I basically started saying I don't know what the hell I was talking about there because um, it was laggy as hell uh, because I'm actually installing Crisis 1, uh, you might be like, why not number 2, but um, I just went out actually and picked up, um, Crisis 2, Resident Evil 5 uh, for Xbox, and Battlefield The Ultimate Collection for that's Battlefield 2. I installed that, but I probably might install that and just keep it as a game to say I've collected because I thought the graphics would be all pretty beast on PC, you know, like, even though it is like from 2005. I did think the graphics would be pretty beast, but they're kind of lacking, which I'm not uh, like insulting the game in any way. It's a beastie game, and I would never knock that game. It's really a good game. I was just having a lot of fun in it then. Um, because it was just like playing against bots, computers, which is just so much fun. Um, it's like basically zombies because you don't have to. It's like it's kind of like combat training, but like just an epic version of it. But I think my Sony Vegas has just froze again. I'm not sure whether it has or not. But no, apparently it's still going. Um, but apparently Crisis 2 is oh epic slow mo. What are we gonna do, Claymore? Oh epic! Th this deserves a thumbs up right now for this epic Claymore. Just saying, you know, just saying this this Claymore. This claymore is gonna is gonna destroy people. Watch this, you ready? What are you looking at? Oh you about to get blown up and then like there we go. Whoa, look how epic that is. I need to do just like some a video code like called like slow mo cinematics or something like that. Where you just see all these zombies getting their faces blown off and stuff like that, which is just epic. But yeah, um montages ju did just used to be like one shot ponies, uh, like one trick ponies I suppose where you just see someone uh, try and get a no scope and if you had to just hit the no scope straight away from the first shot without taking a load of tries. Um it'd go in a montage and you just put a lot of songs and there weren't many transitions, it was just like a quick flick or a, a dazzle HD amazing quality. Uh, sorry, a dazzle pinnacle so uh, f effect. But now everyone's got all these like cinema 4D and all this on all this jazz. But um a lot of people ask me like why did I get into YouTube, who got me into it and uh, blah 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 uh, but the way I got into YouTube um, was I'd probably honestly say from Grizz because at the time I didn't know you could actually record your Xbox or anything I always wanted to but then like uh, when I first started off recording wise um, I did it with, I put a chair in front of my, my TV because I had a pretty big TV I put a chair in front of my TV, stack a load of Xbox games, about 20 Xbox games and then um, put my dad's like camera, who was a pretty good camera. Um, I put that on top of um, the disc, and then like started recording. And uh, that's pretty much how I did it. And um, that's how I'd, I got like most of my gameplays from the start. But then I realised I can't really go on for like that forever. But they were good. I was getting you know like views and the videos and stuff like that. But um, like you know like nothing special. The videos weren't anything special. They're just completely random because I had no like focus as to what I wanted to do with my channel. Um, like I've had pre, I've had, like this has not been my only channel, as I'm sure you know. I've had in the like where should we start? Our first ever YouTube channel was called Tominator 111. Uh, that's actually still going to this day that I just use randomly. Uh, it did actually get uh, a copyright strike, not a copyright, um, community guideline strike on it because I did a, a memory like a tribute to um, what's it called 911 because uh, I just I knew about 911 at the time when I had the channel. But I watched the TV program and it like really changed me and I was like, holy crap, that's just unreal. I think I opened this door now like an idiot. 
yeah there you go I didn't actually mean to do that I was like try to pick up the claymore and reposition it but I opened the door and I was just like fuck I've ruined this game for myself now but uh, luckily I don't just ruin it for myself but I think this is where it starts lagging out and I might down here because I was getting really major frame rate issues and I weren't, I weren't sure why um, but yeah so I that's what got me into it I'd say Grizz because I found out how he did it and then I was like right he used his he uses like a PVR kind of thing um, that, that's what it's done as a PVR uh, I can't actually say what that stands for I'm sure someone in the comments will say what it stands for right now but um, I say we're getting frame rate and it sucks I don't know why because my computer is awesome <laughs> And yeah, so I saw his like his mo a few of his montages, and I was just like, yeah, I just won't be able to record it. And then um, a few of my mates got like PVRs before me, just standard PVRs, uh, so no HD quality or anything like that. And then um, everyone was carrying on using them, and then eventually the community improved and like progressed to having HD PVRs, which were very expensive at the time. No one really wanted to be going spending like 150 pounds or like at the time 200 pounds just for something that will enable you to record your your Xbox or like PlayStation whatever in HD quality no one was really prepared to spend that much amount mornings but now as the community's improved I think a lot of people a lot more people are because they know um, the content is key for you guys hence why I play I'm now playing PC here and um, so I can get the graphics to be awesome and that's why I got my new computer as well because I've always wanted to, I've always wanted to treat myself to a new PC um, but um, I was like, you know what? I'm gonna get a new PC. I'm gonna get an Xbox controlling. I'm going to get a controlling. Winning. Charlie Sheen. Charlie Sheen is winning. Apparently, he's not winning at the moment with his like tour that he's doing. But you know what? You can't judge something until you've seen it. But I'm sure with like some of the bad reviews he got, he'll. Look oh God! I just broke something. I'm really upset because I think it was my speaker. Oh dear, dear. Oh Lordy Lord. And um, so yeah, Grizz basically. It got me into it and then I saw my mate actually started uh, recording so I was like you know what I'm gonna do it uh, so I got a little standard vid uh, capture card a dazzle capture card as a lot of people ask me what to start off with and I kind of recommend you starting off with one of them just to get you used to the basics because you don't want to be like flooding yourself with massive ren massive render times because if you did use just the um, the PVR from like Pinnacle uh, just be like I don't I had like a platinum one I think a planet oh, let's try and move my speaker now oh epic slow-mo this deserves a favorite come on twice in one game surely get ready for this epic slow-mo oh look at that what a beast and then watch this look how good this looks when he walks out of it i carried on slow-mo in it because he just walks straight this guy just comes running straight through it just like fuck the claymore <laughs> Fuck the claymore! Yeah, so I think that was the thing that actually deserved a like and he deserved a favourite, if you know what if you know what I'm saying. I didn't ask for it, I just think it deserves it. Um so yeah, that that was it from there, and then eventually I just thought, you know what, I really um need to get on board with what I wanted to do. And my aim was I always wanted to get on machinima. I set that as an aim for myself and I always really, really wanted to. Um so I got a PVR, started doing some like recording of random stuff and then nuking became kind of my thing and then I was I, I got known as demolition nuking because I just like got nukes and demolition all the time I think that's where I got like 100 plus nukes just in that game mode and um, so I was like you know what I'm like really enjoying this so I thought you know what I'm gonna win I'm gonna improve my quality and um, then I started sent off to machinima and then uh, finally um, I actually got on machinima and was like yay happy in the pants and then that's how it's been from there and that's where who where I am now I'd, I'd, I'd tell more of a story about me I think I'll do it like a special subscriber account um, because a lot of people have said why haven't I set any any new goals um, it's because I've not actually completed all my goals yet um, majority of like the views and subscribe account goals have all completed and that's just crazy thanks to you guys so much but um like it's always good to set yourself goals because when you get it you got that self accomplishment and it, achievement or whatever and it's just like wow this is epic um, I've actually done it like, I never thought in the world of jeebusly boobalicious boobs <laughs> I don't, what the fuck anyway uh, that I'd ever reach 100,000 100, uh, uh, subscribers but I did it with you guys and I appreciate it so much you don't actually understand I don't think you understand how grateful I really am about everything you've helped me achieve and like liking favorite videos just helps like a dramatic amount if I like if I can just upload videos for you guys to enjoy uh, my job's pretty much done and here you can see that this guy's just here below me and he, I think I, I think I down now oh no maybe not I just couldn't see him I think I down pretty, pretty soon anyway but guys if you've enjoyed this video and you actually want me to do a separate story you know talking about how my actual storyline of YouTube and uh, like how I got into gaming and all that jazz then please let me know in the comments below and I want to see the boobaliciously best comment about boobs so I'm Syndicate guys and as always peace out boobies